Greetings everyone. I hope all of you are safe at home. Now today continuing with our large numbers chapter, the very important topics, place, place value, period and face value. We are going to learn about these terms and practice also at the same time. Alright, so let's get started. As you all know, this is the Indian place value system. This is the chart here. These are the places like ones, tens, hundreds, thousands, ten thousands, lakhs and ten lakhs. These are the places we are going to learn about in class 4. And these are the periods. Periods are group of places. Like in ones period you have ones, tens and hundreds. In thousands periods you have thousands and ten thousands. Lakhs period you have lakh and ten lakh. Now, why do we have periods? Periods help us to read a large number. Let me show you how. Suppose this is the number that I have given to you. So, if I write this number over here. So, how do we mark periods? We mark periods by putting commas. Now, here this is my ones period and I have ones, tens and hundreds in ones period. So I am going to look over here like this is ones, tens and hundreds. My ones period is over so I am going to put the comma over here. See if you get a large number without the commas at once it will be very difficult for you to read it right. So with the help of commas you get to know what all places are there. Let me first put the commas. Now here next period is thousands. In thousands period you have thousand and ten thousand. So thousands, ten thousands and here I have marked the period. Now looking after this large number with the commas. Now you can say that yes this is 64 lakhs, 73 thousands, 981. So periods help us to read the large number and also if we are talking about lakhs period, so we are going to read this number together like it's not 60, 6, 10 lakhs or 4 lakhs. No, it is 64 lakhs. This is one period we have to read this number together. 64 lakhs, 73,000. This is one period, thousands. You have thousand, ten thousands in thousands period. So you are going to read this number together. 73 thousands. And this is one period, 981. Remember kids, whenever you are marking periods in a large number, you always start from the one period. We always start from the one period. So this is how we mark period and these are your periods. And in one period, you have these places. Thousands period, you have these two places and lakhs, you have these two places. Let us solve one question. Uh, this such question will make you feel very comfortable about the topic that how to tell period, place, place value and face value in a given number. Now here we have already talked about period. Periods are these commas that we put according to the places. Here this is ones period, thousands and lakhs periods. Wonderful. Now the place, the place like here, what is at which place is the digit in the number? We know that this is ones, tens, hundreds. So if I talk about the place of two, so the place of two is tens. Where is the two placed? It is placed at tens place in the Indian place value chart. So place value, what is the place value? Place value is according to the place of the digit like six. What is the place value? Six into thousand, one thousand. Six thousand is the place value of six in this number. Now face value, face value is the digit itself. It doesn't matter at which place is it. So let's talk about these two. Here one is at ones place and this one is at tens place. So the face value, you, if you look at this, these two digits at different places, it is only one. So the face value doesn't change with the change in places. Here also the face value of 1 is 1 and here also the face value of 1 is 1. Similarly 8. Here the face value of 8 is 8. Here also the face value of 8 is 8. 
so it doesn't change with the places face value remains the same the digit itself all right let's solve this question over here the number is 64 lakhs 64 lakh 96125 now over here of the underlined digit we have to tell all these things so let's see the digit 4 over here what is the period period of this digit 4 so this is ones period thousands period and after thousands you have lakhs period so over here the period of 4 is lakhs yeah over here the period of four is lakhs now at which place what is the place of four in the indian place value chart according to indian place value chart the place of four is lakhs only what is the place value so place value of four is four into one lakh is 4 lakh yeah and what is the face value what are you looking at this digit am i going to call it a digit only no it is 4 so the face value remains the same the digit itself let me solve another one for you now over here on again it's a large number and we can easily read the number because the commas are put the periods are put right so i know this is my one period thousands period and then lakhs period so this is 90 lakh i'm going to read this num period together lakh so 90 lakh 78211 now here we have to talk about 9 the digit 9 in this number so what is the period absolutely lakhs and what is the place of this digit 10 lakhs wonderful and what is the place value yes 9 into 10 lakh which is 90 lakh and the digit itself the face value digit 9 so this number is for you write down the answer write down its period the 4 Write down its period, write down its place, place value and face value in the comment section and let me know whether you have understood this concept or not. Alright, now before wait, before going, let me also take this concept of writing the number, large number in words. Over here, this for this large number, you have to write the number name according to the Indian place value system according to the Indian, Indian place value system, all right? So here, let's first mark the periods because after looking at this number, we, I don't want to count. Let's first, for tough, for tough, come on, mark the periods. Yes, here we have marked the period and now let us write this number in words. So over here, kids, see, 38 lakh 10,000 935 so the number name is basically whatever you are speaking you have to write it down but in a number name children do get confused like the way we have marked commas over here children do mark the commas in the number name also kids we are only putting commas in this numeral so that it is easy for us to read but when we are writing the numbers number names we don't put commas in a number name also, the first letter is capital in a number name. Rest all are in lower case. Alright. So, remember we don't put commas in a number name. And the first letter is capital. Rest all are in lower case. So, this is 38 lakh. And yeah, one more thing. Here, if you have uh, observed, it is lakh. Whereas, whenever we are writing the places, we write lakhs. Okay. So, please keep this thing in mind that in number name, we don't put S in places. We don't put commas in number name. We write the first letter only in capital letter, rest, rest all in lowercase. Now, here for the second number also, if you have seen, we have first marked the periods. 
now we have ones period over here thousands and lakhs period and for lakhs period we have only lakhs place over here so this is going to be four lakh now here we have zero so we are not going to write anything for thousands period zero means nothing so it is going to be blank so we are going to straight away write four lakh one hundred and seventy six there are no commas there are no s in the places and the first letter is capital rest all are in lower case so i hope this video has been very fruitful in understanding making you understand about how we write the number names also and how do we write find the period of a given digit in a number and place place value and face value bye